Snow Scene by John Henry Twopman was painted in 1882 and hangs in the Cincinnati Museum of Art. Twopman was an American Impressionist who was born in Cincinnati and spent his early years studying under the great Frank Duvenek. It was painted just outside of the city and is a great work to study his mastery of edges and brushwork. Snow Scene does not rely on color to tell the story, but instead the simple masses of light and dark. There are subtle shifts of umber to warm up the scene, but it's the edges and the expressive brush strokes that make this work poetic. Twombin creates his hardest edge at the bottom of the foreground tree. No matter where else we look, we're always drawn back to the trunk as it rises out of the snow. He creates the hard edge not only using contrast and value, but also application. Thin vertical strokes of black paint cut through the thickly painted snow, laid with brush strokes that follow the contour of the land. Notice how the strokes change as the tree meets the woods in the background. Twopman changes his application to thick horizontal strokes that contrast against the soft, thinly painted woodland. The sky is painted in a series of short brush strokes that continuously change direction. This randomness gives a feeling of atmosphere and air. The horizontal strokes of the tree against the sky give the trunk structure. The soft edges of the tops of the trees add to the sense of atmosphere, fading into a dark blur to the right of the painting. The calligraphic lines of the limbs and the fence guide us through the composition, shifting from thick to thin and dark to light. This has been a Masterpiece Minute. Thank you for watching and if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you would like more in-depth painting lessons, please visit my Patreon site, The Painter's Classroom, where for $5 a month, you get lessons in the form of videos, blogs, and handouts, plus you get your art questions answered. The link is below.